Good afternoon, Eagle Nick audience. I am Eagle Nick, and I am here at the Huff House. Where it was the headquarters of General Joseph E. Johnston. He is the one who protected Dalton against Sherman's troops during the Civil War when General Sherman was on his march. That is the city hall. When General Sherman was on his march to the sea. He burned Atlanta to the ground and would have did the same to Dalton, Georgia, if it hadn't been for General Joseph E. Johnson. Joseph E. Johnson. President Jefferson Davis. The Confederate President the president of the confederacy they have a civil war museum and research center i do not see no cars here so i do not know if it's open now that light keeps flashing on and off up there that light right here, I've seen it come on and off. Is somebody trying to get my attention? See, it's on again. You see what I mean? You see it's lit up, now it's off. I knew I wouldn't imagine it. This is a house that's been here since the 1800s. It was here during the Civil War. This was actually the house that... General Joseph e. Joseph e. Johnston set up as his headquarters. And I'm going to show you, they got, they moved the statue of General Johnston from downtown and put him back here in a fence to protect him. This is the backside. You see, they got it. Look at these old stones. These stones probably date from the Civil War. They have a little gazebo out there, but you see they have it padlocked. No way that you could get out here to use the gazebo or to get a close-up view of the statue. I'm going to work my way back around to make sure that I stay in the areas that the public is allowed to use. But you see, that's modern air conditioning. I'm sure they didn't have that when Joseph E. Johnston was here. They have it handicap accessible. Disabled accessible. They are flying the American flag, but not our state flag. I wonder why that is. It looks like they would have our Georgia flag represented as well. Secured by Owen Security Systems. Well, Eagle Nick is just recording... We all know who that is and who they work for, don't we? Look, um, a, a magnolia tree. That is one tree that grows a lot in Georgia is a magnolia. You know, there was a, a movie made called Steel Magnolias. Now, I can't tell if that is open or not, but I'm not going to try to go inside because they could try to get me for trespassing. 
if I did. But this is where they moved the statue of General Johnston, who was downtown. You see, they made a lot bigger of a base for him to where he is in more prominent. But it is right here by the railroad tracks. I see a city police officer coming up to there. He's going the other way, though. He didn't come this way. But they moved him from, he was in downtown, right there close to the Wink Theater. A bunch of college kids and a bunch of woke liberals complained enough until they moved him in fear that they was going to destroy the statue You know, if we don't remember the past, we're doomed to repeat it. See if I can zoom in on it. Well, I can't get my zoom to working. But I wanted to do this to show people where they moved General Johnston. And like I said, if it hadn't been for him, he would have burnt, General Sherman would have burnt Dalton to the ground just like he did Atlanta and Savannah when he made it to Savannah on his march to the sea. Eagle Nick audits. I am Eagle Nick, and I'm out.